Hi guys, Jenna here from Soul Rebels. Thank you for joining me today. Um, if you have watched my workouts before, uh, welcome back and thank you for your support. If you are new today, then welcome and thank you for joining me. Today's workout is gonna be a total body dumbbell workout. Uh, we're gonna use light dumbbells. It's the only equipment you're gonna need. I'm gonna be using uh, six pound dumbbells. So feel it out for yourself. You might need a little bit more, might need a little bit less. Um, we're gonna be doing three uh, dynamic warm-ups, and then we're gonna go into three exercises for the actual workout. And we're gonna start with um, lateral to curtsy lunges, which is gonna work out our glutes and our inner thighs. Um, then we're gonna do some re bent over reverse flies, and that's gonna work out our shoulders and our upper back. And we're gonna follow that up with 360 degree planks, which is gonna just light up our entire core, front, back, and sides. So I'm excited about this workout. I think it's a pretty good one. So let's get started. Uh, we're gonna start with some leg swings. So you can actually hold on to a wall if you need a little extra support to do these. I prefer to do them just standing and holding onto my hips because I like the extra challenge of balance. So we're gonna swing our legs out and over the front like this, and we'll do 10 left and 10 right. So let's start with my right, your left. Let's do 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Good. Do our other foot. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. That'll help loosen up our hips a little bit. Next uh, warm up is called groiners. So we get down into a high plank position. And what you're going to do is, if starting with your right foot, you will bring, holding that plank nice and solid, bring that right foot up towards your right hand as best you can. It's all gonna, you know, depend on your flexibility with how much you can do. That's fine, do as much as you can. This is gonna help to open up our hips as well. So we're gonna do, we're gonna alternate sides and we're gonna do 10 total. So high plank position, ready? One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. Those might feel a little bit awkward, but that's okay. So our next warm up is going to be seal jacks, which is a jumping jack with our hands out in front of us. Jump out, arms come out back together. Now, if jumping is not your thing, then you can just go side to side. We're gonna do 20 of these total. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, plus 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. It's hard to count and jump at the same time. <laughs> That'll help to loosen up our shoulders for our uh, upper body workout. So that's it for our warm up. I feel like we've touched base on everything that we're gonna be uh, actually trying to strengthen today. So grab your dumbbells. First exercise we're gonna start with is our lateral to curtsy lunge. And this is a great leg shaper. Um, I really do like this exercise. It's gonna work out your, 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 boot, your glutes as well as your inner thighs. And it's kind of a twofer because we're gonna do a lateral lunge and a curtsy lunge. And that's gonna count as one rep. So standing nice and tall, dumbbells at your side. We're gonna take 
a wide step out. Keep your toes pointing forward. And you want to bend that knee and kind of stick your butt up. Imagine pointing it back towards the wall behind you. Bend down. Try to keep your chest up. Come back up to center. And then we're going to curtsy, curtsy lunge. So you can just kind of tap that right, right knee down on the ground and come back up to center. So that is one rep. So as we go to out to the side in the lateral lunge, you're gonna feel it in that glute, in that quad and hamstring, all that good stuff. And when you change over to that curtsy lunge, you're gonna feel it shift into that opposite glute and opposite leg. So we're really working out both sides throughout this whole exercise. We're gonna do eight reps on one side, eight reps on the other. So let's get started. Stepping out, I'm gonna start with my right, you start with your left. So let's go. Lateral lunge, back to center, curtsy lunge. That's one. Back to center, curtsy lunge. Two, keep your toes pointed forward. Try to keep your chest high. Three. Four, push off those heels. Try to feel it in that glute. Five. Six. Seven, last one. Eight, great. Now we're gonna switch sides, okay? This side might feel a little bit different than the side you just did. You know, our flexibility differs on both sides. Sometimes we have a little imbalance. So if it feels a little different, it's okay. Listen to your body, do what you can based off of your flexibility. All right, step out, lunge, back to center, curtsy. One, out, center, curtsy. Two, out, center, curtsy. Three, out, center, curtsy. Four, out, curtsy. Five, out, center, curtsy. Six, Curtsy, seven, out, center, curtsy, eight. Very good. Those are, uh, those are a tough one. I'm gonna grab some water here. All right. Next exercise, we're going to do bent over reverse flies. This is gonna work out our shoulders and our upper back. Great one for posture, all about good posture. So with these, we are going to start dumbbells at our side. Use the same dumbbell weight you used for your legs. If you're not as strong up top, then just grab something a little bit lighter. We're gonna be doing 15 of these, so trying to get through 15 reps. We're gonna slight bend at the knees. Bend our torso over, about 45 degree angle, and let your arms hang in, hang in front of you with the dumbbells. Slight bend in your elbows, and we're going to come up and back, squeezing those shoulder blades. Come back down. Control it coming down, don't just let the weights fall. And let's do 15 of these. This is gonna engage your core to keep your body upright. If that's too much for you, you could always do these in a seated position using a bench or the edge of a chair. Um, but then you won't get the great core workout that you get from these standing. So let's begin. Ready? And out. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
seven, eight, nine, ten. Five more. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. One more. Fifteen. Very good. Now, if you start to feel those in your lower back a little bit, just stand back up and reposition yourself and then get back into your position. So, all right, now we're down to 360 degree planks. For these, we are going to be doing 15 second planks. We're gonna start with front planks, side plank, back plank, side plank. So we're gonna work out all around our core. And I'm going to do a high plank position for these. Like that. If you prefer something lower, then you can always get down on your forearms and we can do the planks like that. So your choice. Okay, let's start with the front plank first and we're gonna hold for 15 seconds. So getting up on your toes, get your shoulders over your wrists, tuck your belly button in, and let's hold this. Breathe as normal as you can. Hold it. And go ahead and drop down to your knees. We'll move to a side plank. Again, you can do these down, down lower if you prefer. I'm gonna do mine up. Okay, I like to turn my hand out at about a 45 degree angle here. Some people point their fingers forward or completely out. It's just based off of your personal preference and your flexibility. So, I'm on my left arm, my left leg goes straight out, and I am going to use my right leg to help push me up into position. Okay? Ready? Let's go up. And then I prefer to put my feet on top of each other. You can stagger them if you prefer. So let's hold for 15 seconds. Keep those hips up. Keep holding, almost there. Okay, we can drop down. Kind of lower yourself down using your other leg so you don't just flop down to the ground. Okay, now we're gonna do back planks. Now, if you're doing them from your forearms, you can get down like this, okay? And you're gonna just push your hips up off the ground. I'm gonna do the high plank. Again, turning my hands out a little bit because that's more comfortable for me. And we are going to pick those hips up. Hey, Dreamer, you gonna join us? Here, come over here, come on. Good, lay down. Good, stay, stay. Good girl, stay. Okay. So we're going to come up, push those hips up towards the ceiling. Okay, try to make a nice straight line. We're gonna hold this for 15. Engage those glutes, hold it. These are probably the tougher out of all of them. Great, all right, lower yourself down. Very good. Now we'll go to the other side to complete our 360 degrees. Get on that right hand, right leg comes straight out. Use my left leg to help me up. All right, on top or stagger, whatever you prefer. This gives you a little more stability. Okay, keep those hips up, keep that core nice and tight and hold it. Breathe, don't forget to breathe. Don't just hold your breath through it. No 
Okay, use that other leg to help lower yourself down. Whew, great. So that was our 360 degree plank. First set is done. Take a few seconds, grab a drink of water, regain your strength so we can go into our next set. Pretty strong girl. <sighs> okay, let's grab our dumbbells and we will start with our lateral de curtsy lunges. Good. Again, wide step out to the side, back to center, curtsy, center. Okay, that's one rep. Ready? Let's go. Out, center, curtsy, center. One. Two. Three. When you lunge out like this, try to get your other leg as straight as possible. Four. Six, two more. Seven, last one. Eight, good. Regain your balance. Let's start on the opposite side. Wide step, lunge. Center, curtsy. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. My left side. I definitely don't have quite as much flexibility in my hip as my right. Six. So it does feel a little bit different. If you have the same issue, just do your best. Last one. Eight. Very good. Finally starting to sweat a little bit. Let's regain our composure. We'll move into our reverse flies. I'll show you from the profile this time. Bend those knees. Stick your booty out. Hang your arms down. Now try to keep your shoulders down, away from your ears, you know, as opposed to hiking them up like that, which is what we tend to do sometimes. If you find yourself doing that, maybe your weight's a little bit too heavy, drop it down. So bring your shoulders down and back. Ready? We're gonna do 15. One, hold your core nice and tight. Two, three, four, five, six. Keep your neck neutral. Don't try to look up. Seven. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, last one, 15. Very good. Those will help you stand up straighter. All right, let's go down to our planks. Okay, I'll show you from the profile these. Again, get down on your forearms if you must. I want to do the high plank, okay. Ready, let's go up, 15 seconds. Four, 
Breathe. Remember to breathe. You might start to shake a little. That's okay. That's good stuff. All right. Drop down to your knees. Get to our side, either side. Okay. Hand down, leg straight out. Help yourself up. Get a nice long line here. And let's hold. Push those hips up towards the sky. Breathe. Okay, drop it down. Go to our back plank. And get yourself in position. Lift your hips up. Engage your glutes. Hold it. Dig your heels into the ground. Breathe. Drop it. All right. Hey, girl. Now we're going to go to the other side. Up high. Leg straight out. Help yourself up. Foot over the other. And hold. Bring those hips up. Try to keep a nice long line. And down. Whew, very good. Those are a total body, total body workout in itself. Okay. Two sets done. We'll flow into our third set. Take a quick few seconds, grab some water, catch your breath, and we'll finish strong. Everything should be nice and warmed up and activated at this point. So this will be our best set, no doubt. Okay, I'm ready if you are. I'm actually gonna show you these from the side this time. Here, I'll show you this way. I'm gonna start with my right. Lunge out to the side, back to center, curtsy lunge back. Ready? Let's go side lunge. Center, curtsy lunge, center, one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, very good. Next side, out, center, curtsy, one. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, last one, and eight. 
Take a few seconds. All right, and into reverse flies here. 15 reps. Slight bend in the legs. Hinge at your hips, hang your arms down, and keep your shoulders back. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Keep going. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. One more. Fifteen. Whew. Last one of those. All right, let's get down. We'll do our planks. Starting with our front plank. Ready? And up. Breathe. Good, drop down. Switch to the side. Pick yourself up. Okay, hips up. Hold it. Nice and strong. Good. Drop it down. Go to our back plank. Okay, ready? Up, engage those glutes in your core. Dig those heels in. Nice long body. Breathe. All right, drop it down. Last one, other side. Pick yourself up, bring those hips up. Nice strong body. Breathe, hold it. This is it, we're at the home stretch. Right, drop it down. That's it. We're done. Great job. That has me sweating big time here. I'm dripping sweat. So I know that's a good workout. I hope you got a good workout in too. Uh, thank you for joining me again today. I hope you got a great workout in and if you found this video helpful, then please give it a thumbs up. And if you would like to support our channel and see more videos like this, then please subscribe. We appreciate all the support we've received so far, and we look forward to many more, many more workouts with you. So, till next time, have a great day. Bye.